Uh, okay, so what we have here is the newest tuner from Peterson, Strobe, which is the clip-on, and uh, we all want to be in tune, right? So, starting out, you just pick out your guitar. Sounds awesome. Um, I love teaching with the clip-on tuners just because I find it's just really convenient to just always have a tuner on hand. Oh, hit a squeaker, chord sounds awful. So, I use those tuners for that. Uh, the strobe tuner, it's just like, you know, small, plastic, uh, seems pretty durable, haven't had it for a long time, but, you know, you don't really trash them around a whole lot, it's the same thing as, uh, the Apex is what I was using for a long time, uh, the Pet Peterson just came out, uh, very recently now, so, um, I'm just going to show you a little comparison test between the two, just pop them both on here, okay, so, um, you know, Peterson are just, you know, well known as being by far the most accurate tuners for guitar players and stuff. So, uh, I don't know, whatever is about the camera here that I'm using, can't really see the main screen here on the Apex. But you can see almost like a reflection of what would be there when it's tuned in the headstock here. So, uh, yeah, you have a look at that. You also see the little LED on the Apex light up when it's in tune. But mostly what I'm just trying to show you is that even though this one here says it's in tune, the Peterson takes it a couple of steps further with uh, accuracy, as you'd expect. So just go through and tune a horribly tuned guitar. And you can see that the stroll reacts very, very well. Never loses sight of the note at any time. So, now right there, the apex is saying it's in tune, but you can see that the uh, Peterson is still saying, oh, you look flat. So I'm still tuning, and the apex has stopped moving. And there, the other one changes direction. I like a lot about the Peterson is it immediately catches the note, the pitch, tells you exactly where you need to go with it. And the way I see the dial, you know, it seems like it's almost going in the opposite direction that you want, but it's always just telling you where the note is all the time. So it's rolling down saying that, you know, the note is a little bit too far down. And again, you see that the apex has stopped with the LED on, but the uh, Peterson's still telling me that I need to tune a little bit more. I'm moving around to sort of demonstrate a little bit of the tuner's accuracy and everything. None of us would be able to hear the difference, of course, in any of those pitches. Well, I'm sure some of you guys can, but maybe you can give me a few lessons. And I'll just quickly get everything rolling here. What I like also with the Peterson, for guys who play a lot of down-tuned guitars, um, if you're playing fast enough at down tuning, um, your strings go out of tune the harder you hit the strings, but you still want to play down tune, you still want to hit the guitar heavy. The Peterson kind of has the accuracy where you can tune uh, whatever your attack is. So, say if you hit the string harder, you know, that's saying that my A is you know, a little bit sharp, so I can down tune a little bit, so even though I'm getting the kind of the flubby tuning from the, uh, the looser strings, you have the option to be able to keep them all in tune for the faster style songs. It works good in the studio and stuff. Uh, I've got our drop D. So we'll just do a little check here and see what Peterson tells us. He's pretty happy with our E. B's a little flat. The apex is long, giving up telling us the difference between any of these. It's all saying that all of them are perfectly in tune. The little sweetener idea that they have there for the Peterson, I find, is just a really nice touch. 
Also, you hear little pings and stuff on the nut there. Um, there's a lubricant that you can buy. It's called Big Ben's Nut Sauce. It works fantastic. Big Ben's Nut Sauce for keeping those pings away. And as you can see, I haven't used enough of it, um, but that's okay. So anyway, uh, the newest and latest greatest clip-on tuner, in my opinion, is the new Peterson Strobe Tuner. And uh, uh, you know, I was personally in the beginning of the things that we do. Uh, a guy that I always talk to for all my gear needs is Andre, down at Tapestry Music here in uh, Vancouver, actually White Rock area. And he'll definitely hook you up, and we'll put some links up and stuff so you guys can find out where all this stuff is. If you're in the greater Vancouver region, you got to call them for all your gear, because I do. Um, yeah, so good luck clip-on tuners. Uh, the best one I've seen so far is the Peterson Strobe Tuner. Just newly released, uh, like, you know, um, beginning of August, I think, of this year, 2010.